He has seven. Cougars within 11, and again, that's been the main margin, the halftime margin. The defensive breakdown right from Harmon will go. Touched by Gustav, and now Kenny Robinson emerges with it. For the Cougars as we go under 12 minutes. Dish to Carson going down low to Pedroso. Double team back out to Carson. Working around. That's got to leave somebody open. And it's Rustoff in the corner, but it won't fall. Pulled down by Yuli. Rustoff slows down Ventura a little bit with a deflection in the backcourt. Little confusion on the last defensive set by the Cougars. Two guys left the, the shooter totally by himself. Harmon, Bachev, and Ristoff with some help. Arrington will send it back to Dooley, 17 to shoot. Pull it up, it's going to be Harmon, three won't go. Pedroso reaching out, got the rebound with some contact and drew a foul as well on Arrington. The sense here, I think partially because of the lead and maybe just to save the team a bit, uh, Ventura, when they're not getting the immediate quick strike, they're starting to settle down a little bit more in that half court. Definitely, yeah, they have a nice little passing game, and they, you know the clock's their friend. They need to run that down. Pedrosa, I love the way he's always around the ball. Fifth team foul on Ventura, and the second one there on Arrington. 11-11 left, 13 game, as in 13 point differential. Carson rolling it to Ristop, moving inside, working on Arrington, going to the left hand, hung on the rim, wouldn't go, and McMurray pulls it down. Logging over to Dooley, ball fake. Back over to McMurray. He'll take a three over Rustov. Got there a little bit late. Carson snatches it away from Arrington. Pedroso pushing it up, going inside, attacking, and a blocking foul called, but before the shot. So Michael Harmon called for a second. Right. That was a bang bang play, and referee Healy saw that as a block. I like the aggression. I do not think, Randy, that we have tried an outside shot in this first 10 minutes or so, or nine minutes or so of this half. Is that, is that right? That sounds about right. Anthony Mormon, after a long breather, in for McMurray, who ate a lot of minutes in the post. 13-point game with 10.44 remaining. A little floor maintenance. We got the squeak, and now uh, Robinson ready to key it in. <coughs> we'll lob it to Ristoff. Carson off the pick. It's left open. The three a little bit off the mark. Ristoff trying to clang inside and get the rebound. And it is out of bounds off Cuesta. Officials really let them play. That was maybe a little over the back on that one, but they, they're letting them play, which is, is great. That's I think, yeah, and I think it's been consistently that way all game. It's something you like in officiating that it's consistent. I love it. You don't even know they're out there. That's a good sign. Consistency in individuals and for a crew. Flicked it out by the Cougars, 17 to shoot. So it's the 11-point mark here that the Cougars have not been able to take it below this half. Remember, they had it as close as two uh, with about three minutes left in the first half. And then Ventura put together a nice little 10 or 12 point run. Harmon going inside, working against Botchev. Won't go Mormon, was it? Knocked out by Botchev. And here comes Kenny Robinson. Robinson pushing up in the front court, back over to Ristoff. Ristoff couldn't get in rhythm, sends it back over to Petroso. He'll charge inside. He'll go left hand off the glass. It's good. Oscar Petroso gets the Cougars back to single digit for the first time in a long time as we go under 10 minutes to go in the game, 59-50. Timeout called by Joey Ramirez, who's probably very aware of that as well. Cougars, though, able to get things going a little bit. You're right, not going for that outside and not hoping the shots will fall, but trying to find ways to create inside. The size, you know, again, the glass really hasn't worked for him, but some of the slashing we've seen from Pedroso and others has been working. Definitely a difference uh, between this and the first half. Uh, it was an outside game, uh, totally the first half. and. Uh, the few uh, inside shots they got, they were, they were missing. So obviously at halftime, they decided to do more penetration, get the ball inside, drive. Um, again, the uh, foul situation is favorable to Cuesta. One more, and they're in the 
one and one. So we might get that pace where we can slow the game down, score without moving the clock, and and climb back in. Um, Soto being on the bench is definitely helpful. He has three. I expect to see him re-enter, if not in this set of plays, but uh, very shortly because he is definitely the man that makes the engine run here. You know, he, right now he's watching and not sitting, so I think they're going to hold him out a little bit longer. Two Cougars, though, in double digits now. Ristoff with 12 and Pedrosa with 11 unofficially. Arrington is pacing all scores with 18 unofficially. Mormon's got 12. Harmon also in double figures as well as Soto. 11 and 10, so four double figure scores for Ventura where, you know, and again, that's how it's been historically for them this year where they've really had the scoring concentrated in three of those four. It normally has been Anthony Mormon, uh, Naji Salam we have not seen, who's been an 11 and a half in the game, and also uh, Dooley has been averaging almost 15, and we have seen very little from him tonight as Ristov flex it out. Kenny Robinson quiet, too. You know, always potential for him to kind of take things over, so he's He's done a good job. He's playing well. Uh, Controlling the pace, you talked about that last part of the first half. Those were the only minutes that he was out in the first half where Ventura took advantage and made a run. Bashev watching in the defense. And again, we're seeing that Ventura kind of set play where we've got, got some cuts back score. Well, running the Dooley. clock down. Yep. Clearly. Dooley getting Pedrosa airborne. Gave an open look. Was unable to make it. Mormon with a tap and wrist off. Pulls down the rebound. Cougars, having in single digits, can knock it down a little bit further with 9.15 to go. Robinson, out high now, Ristoff will take the feed. Going inside, inside. Yep. Bashev is moving very fluidly tonight. Take away jumper, this looks so smooth. Vasil Bashev with nine. They've all looked effortless. Harmon going inside. All knocked away and that will be a foul. Might be, I'm sure, Bashev. Yep, and that's exactly what it is. Vasil Bashev for this third foul. Vasil averaging 5.7 a game, but nine to nine off the bench. Yeah, last time down, Ventura spent 20, 25 seconds before they took a shot. This time, uh, dribble drive, the shot's up in five or six seconds. So they just keep changing the pace. That's hard to adjust to, too, defensively. Well, the Cougars have knocked it to seven. Harmon with a free throw, pushes it back to eight, and now nine. 13 points for Zell Michael Harmon, under nine minutes to go. Kenny Robinson to bring it up with <coughs> Kyrie Carson right in shotgun. And Petroso. Then outside, gets a pick from Ristoff. Now we'll go down to Ristoff, coming off that pick. Looking inside, 17 to shoot, plenty of time. Ristoff, shoulder fake going inside, tried to go back door, gets it to Carson. Carson off the glass and one. They say Plum and Ristoff there, real good patience inside. The shoulder fake didn't see that maybe he had the best shot. Saw Kyrie Carson found a way got to get in. it to him. And he muscled it up and got the foul and uh, got the shot. And we're in the bonus next time we shoot. Yeah, foul is the seventh. And as the first one on Mormon, Kyrie Carson with a chance to make it a three-point play. 73% shooter. Converts. Ten points for Kyrie Carson in a starting role tonight. That's over his average, and the Cougars have stepped old, back down to six with eight and a half to go. The old-fashioned three. That, love it. Over to Mormon, moving off the block. Pass pulled him off a little bit. Harmon out high. Bashev getting the hand up. Harmon trying to maneuver around. Fadeaway jumper over. Bashev has stayed with him, won't go. One-handed rebound. Mormon had it, lost it, pulled out. Dooley coming outside. Dooley, quick dribble, trying to take Pedrosa off the dribble. Little contact. Again, they're letting him play, like Jim said. Arrington out high, 22 to shoot. Eight-minute mark just passed. Co Coach Ramirez wants to run the clock. His players look like they want to go do a little one-on-one -on -one here. So let, let's see who wills out here in the... Uh... Arrington isolated, but you can see his interior team does look a little tired right now. Arrington going, and then didn't look tired there. Went right past Ristop. And laid it in, Jalen Arrington unofficially with 20, eight-point game. Very explosive team. Ventura. They can beat them one-on-one, -on -one and obviously they know it. <laughs> Ristoff going inside around Mormon, got the whistle. Ristoff found the opening and attacked the paint. Fouls on Arrington, I believe that's his third. That's the eighth team foul. So again, chance for the Cougars, as you said, Jim, to make some... Uh, 
points there with the clock stopped. In this case, 728 and down eight. This is the recipe for a rally. <laughs> totally. Ristoff first of two. Rattles out. Plum and Ristoff, top free throw shooter on the team and one of the best in the conference. Yeah, just under 84%. Makes one of two. Ristoff has 13. Seven point ball game. Harmon walks it up. Bashev waiting for it. Okay, back to a passing game. Run, run the clock down. Arrington picked up by Ristoff. 15 to shoot. Ristoff, keep an eye on him. Ristoff again. Plays big at 6 4. Very quick, but reached out and made contact. Only. Although, considering the way this game has gone, that's. Interesting, I guess in the open court, that's going to be a foul in this game. That's the second one on Ristoff and the fifth on the Cougars. Yeah, they're only at five fouls. They can take a chance to try to make some steals. The uh, top, the front man beats our guard almost consistently. So Cuesta has to close down the defense in the middle once the, once the outside guard for Ventura makes a move up the middle. He should be met with uh, several white uniforms. Bashev up top 6-5 and some quickness. 12 to shoot. Dooley had it dropped it right back going to Mormon. Off the glass won't go, but he got the foul. 16 foul on the Cougars. Now Mormon will go to the line for a couple. First foul on Kyrie Carson. Mormon on the year. 60% free throw shooter, but made two earlier. First one is good. He stays perfect with the line. He's got 13. I've been keeping my eye on Soto. He just moved up next to the coach. I think he'll be back in next stop whistle. Waiting for the time again. Big game for Mormon. Just one point in their last game against Morpheus.